children how are you i hope you all are doing well and listening to your parents in the last class we did the boy and the toffees hope you all enjoyed the chapter we end our first semester english literature syllabus with that chapter so now as we are approaching towards the end of this semester we must get on to our revisions as well from today onwards we will be revising the lessons i have taught you previously moreover you can also watch the previous videos for your revision as well today we will revise inside aisha's house aisha is a small girl who lives in her house with her father mother and small brother rinku did you all remember children in this lesson we will recall everything we have seen in her house and what she likes to do so take out your mulberry book page number 16 now children let us look at aisha's house and find out how she spends time with her family this is aisha's bedroom aisha loves to look out of the window before going to sleep this is the bathroom aisha brushes her teeth twice a day she does not waste water while bathing follow children we should not waste water this is the living room here aisha watches the best tv show the little monkey with her family this is the kitchen aisha's mother and father make yummy food together this is the dining room aisha her little brother rinku mother and father sit and eat delicious food together sometimes rinku chews his food noisily then aisha shows him the proper way of eating now children what is the meaning of delicious the meaning of delicious is tasty what is the meaning of noisily the meaning of noisily is making noise did you all follow children take out page number 18 making connections quick answers number 1 put a tick against the correct answer children can you see the picture yes there are two options number 1 there is a bed number 2 there is a bathtub now a what can you see in the bedroom the answer will be number 1 bed so put a tick mark beside number 1 b what can you see in the bathroom there are two options children there's a picture of a basin wash basin yes dear and number 2 there's a picture of a swing so the correct answer is number 1 wash basin now 
put a tick mark beside number 1 c how many rooms are there in aisha's house number 1 4 number 2 5 the correct answer is number 1 there are four rooms yes which are the rooms bedroom bathroom living room and dining room did you all follow children now number 2 what does aisha do when rinku chooses food noisily put a tick against the correct answer there are three options children a she joins him and starts chewing her food noisily too b she shows him how to eat properly c she complains to her parents so the correct answer is b so put a tick beside number b she shows him how to eat properly next read reflect and write number 3 do you like aisha's house why or why not yes i like aisha's house because her house is neat and tidy did you all follow children yes i like aisha's house because her house is neat and tidy number 4 an igloo is also a type of house so is a cave how many kinds of houses do you know about next igloo is a snow hut did have you seen a picture of igloo a lion lives in a cave a dog lives in a kennel a horse lives in a stable hens live in a coop rabbits live in a burrow did you all follow children integrate we have seen what is inside aisha's house now tell us what you have seen at your friends or neighbor's house there are four rooms in my friend's house did you see your friend's house children yes the house has one bedroom one bathroom one living room and one dining room with a small kitchen the bedroom has one bed one dressing table and a cupboard the living room has one tv set one sofa set and one center table the dining room has one dining table and four chairs did you all follow children now word wall children please take out your pencils and be careful this is a house number 1 match the correct words to the pictures a there are three options children number 1 cushion number 2 bed number 3 sofa so match number 3 with the sofa number b number 1 door number 2 curtain number 3 window match number 1 with the door number c number 1 stove number 2 oven number 3 cups and saucers so match number 3 with the cups and saucers number d number 1 chair 
number two table and number three stool. So match number two with the table. Did you all follow children? Now this is how we complete page number 19. Now children can you tell me what do we do in the bedroom? Yes, we sleep in our bedroom. Aisha brushes her teeth in her bathroom. In the same way, you clean yourself in your bathroom. Aisha watches her best TV show, The Little Monkey, with her family. Just like that, you watch your favorite TV shows in the living room. Do you watch cartoons, children? Yes, you sit with your family and watch your favorite TV shows in the living room. Your mummy cooks yummy food in her kitchen. And lastly, you eat delicious food all together in the dining room with your family. Did you all understand children? That's all children. I hope this revision helped you with a better understanding and memorizing what you learnt earlier. You can carry on your previous assignments given to you. Along with that, practice the exercises given at the end of this chapter. Thank you children. Stay home.